What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So first things first, if you haven't seen on my Instagram, a bitch is back blonde. My hair is like not done. It's just, it's just kind of like left over from when it was done the other day. So that's why it just looks a bit like straight, curly, all sorts. But I'm obsessed with the color. It is my favorite yet. And I'm so glad that you guys have been loving it too over on my Instagram. If you're not following me there, Make sure you do it right now. But for today's video, um, I had a lot of requests when I said I was going to be doing moving vlogs and stuff to kind of do one of just, I don't know, like exploring because I'm in a completely new city to where I was before. And today, me and Jack are just going to go to B&M and Dunelm. And if you don't know what they are, they are homeware stores, really like affordable homeware stores in the UK. I'm not sure if you can get them. Um, in America or anything like that, but um, I've actually never been inside a B&M before And I've definitely been inside a Dunelm, but we're still gonna be exploring around that area and see what else is there And then we're gonna go into town and get some lunch and find some cool places to eat So I just thought this would be like a fun vlog I can also do a little mini haul at the end if I do manage to pick anything up in B&M and Dunelm So I'll make sure to show you that but yeah, I just thought I would take you along with me on like a casual Casual little day and I just thought this would make um, some cute content And if you guys are in the Manchester area and I'm going to somewhere maybe that you've never been before To eat because we're gonna do like some investigating and find somewhere really cute I hope So that's what we're doing today If you like the sound of this video then please give it a thumbs up Right now um, it really just helps me know that you guys are enjoying these moving vlogs And I'll make sure to do some more um, We are getting a lot of deliveries this week The official flat tour is you know in it's in sight, I can see it, we're getting there and I just want it to be in a position that um, I'm happy to show you. So I'm gonna wait till all of that sort of stuff arrives but for now, I just thought I would take you along with me on kind of like a day in the life type thing and go exploring and that's my alarm to say, get your ass downstairs because Jack will be there. So yeah, we're gonna go exploring, let's go uh, on this little adventure. Stop. Do, 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 do. Oh <laughs> God, I've stepped in for two seconds and I've been hit with the, what would you call that? Cutlery. Plates. Crockery. Crockery. And this really goes with the Ikea mugs that I just got. Guys, no, my bathroom is black and gold, so I've just hit the, like, the jackpot of storage and accessories and there's like some black metal things over there that jack is eyeing up to guys got some baby pink accessories for my spare bathroom i've made jack carry my pillows for me but it's going well so far we definitely should have got a trolley but now we're upstairs looking at like the rugs oh the faux fur throws what we like yeah what we like, oh, what we like. So i'm like really into the incense and i found this one it's called saffron and tonka it says limited edition and it's rose gold so i feel like i might get that for my kitchen it smells i don't really know how to describe it but it smells unreal so i feel like i'm gonna get this in the basket we're in basket heaven you basket case nah guys look how cute these like little woven baskets are i told you we're now in like a different kind of basket heaven these are like so cute for throws and stuff like that that i was saying in ikea oh my goodness and there's like metal metal things over there oh my god literally please can someone else confirm that they are obsessed with like storage and just cute little things like this as much as i am oh my goodness we've hit the mother load so these are all like one pound each little like troughs and trays for I don't know what but I'm definitely going to be picking up a few of these and there's some like deeper dish ones down here as well so I don't actually have that many shirts in my cupboard so these things are like so handy but we've just come and like this is when I realized that I don't have any like cool utensils I just got the basic ones like who know that like a tea bag squeezer existed Jack's put it straight into his basket <gasps> Mm. Oh my god, they've got rose-filled handles, I can't play. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, you can't play that in public. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, these are so good. Obviously, if you're a renter, you know command strips are like the only thing that you can... What is that with my camera? It's the only thing that you can use. What is going on with my camera when I do that? That's so weird. I've got command strips like your best friend if you're a renter. So, just got myself some in your basket.
looked that we need to go shopping anymore, but we're on to the next destination. Okay, guys, what the fuck? So, like I said, I've never been to a B&M before, and this is so random. They just do big sizes of everything and stuff I've never seen before, like Milka chocolate brownies. This was the last one, so I've obviously had to pick it up. <laughs> Jack's talking up in his coffee, like, who needs that size of the kettle here like bags they are huge we're back in the older candle section and look at all these like cute gold like plants and stuff like that i feel like this is where i'm gonna be completely sucked in oh fashion vogue darling my really great b m shop <laughs> Right, you guys, I am back home now. As you can see, it did some damage. Didn't really get much in B&M, except like loads of little randomly like food bits. But I feel like I will do a kind of full sort of haul unboxing when I get back, because now we are gonna go out and find somewhere to eat for lunch. And um, we haven't really decided what we're like in the mood for yet or that kind of thing, but we wanna try and find somewhere different that we've not been before, so. Here we go. Okay, we thought we were gonna be creative, but I don't think we are, but we really want Thai food. And Elliot wants to play in the meter. Guys, this looks so fucking good. So good. You with your weird eggs. Mm. But this looks so yummy. Model. Right, so I didn't want to do it exactly like I've done all my other videos because I feel like that would just be boring. So I thought I would just do a little overview and go through everything. It is now like dark outside. I've just had a few hours of just getting my life together and it's been amazing. So the only thing I actually ended up getting from B&M is this plant. Uh, to go in my bathroom because it was gold. Um, so yeah, other than the foodie bits, that's the only bit that I got. Anyway, moving on to what I got from Dunelm. So first things first, I got this duster that actually, wait, hold on. It like extends so I can go along all my surfaces. I'm gonna have some high shelves in my bathroom, so I thought that would be good. Um, I got some sort of like brittle sponges for cleaning dishes and my sink. Speaking of which, I got an in-sink organizer as well that just like sucks onto the side, so it's not gonna do any damage, which I love. I got some Zaflora, I got this in in the scent Midnight Blooms, um, just to disinfect my sink and that kind of good stuff. Um, I got some more sponges for cleaning as well. I kind of get a little bit obsessed with cleaning, I'm not gonna lie. Speaking of which, I got some Astonish Kitchen Cleaner. And like I said, I got some command hooks as well because if you're a renter, these are amazing. I got some room scents, which smell so beautiful and like oody, um, kind of like Huda Beauty perfume vibes, if you know that kind of scent so I got this one for the kitchen because it's rose gold and this one's sort of for my living room. I then got some pink accessories for my spare bathroom because it's a baby pink theme. Speaking of which I got a baby pink hand towel as well to go in there so I'll pop those together so I remember. I then got these metal gold wire frames to um, act as storage. I'm going to mix and match with these and kind of like white plastic ones in my bathroom and I got some black flannels because I just make flannels so dirty so blacks just kind of kind of make them not look as dirty even though I know they still will be but at least from the offset they won't look it and I got like this yellow colored towel just to kind of mix up with the gold and black theme and kind of act as a gold color and um, I got some of the acrylic plastic organizers like I said I also got a black oh, black bath mat as well to go in my bathroom and you guys are gonna think I'm crazy but I got more pillows because my current ones, I thought with the Ikea ones would kind of, you know, work well, but I just still really hate them. So I got these ones, which are so good and they were actually really, really affordable as well. And I actually got that basket up there from Dunelm, which I'm gonna put um, blankets and stuff in as well. So that's literally everything that I got today and just like, yeah, a kind of like a day in my life, it's sort of exploring, going to new places, just getting little bits for the flat. This is kind of like what I'm doing. Yeah, like I said, a day in my life at the moment, just getting my life in order and together. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up if you are loving these moving vlogs. If you are from Manchester and have any more exciting like food suggestions, places to go, things like that that you think I should do and maybe even vlog, leave them in the comment section down below. But yeah, I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, I already said that, but give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.